Hello everyone, how you guys doing? Hope you're going to have an awesome day today. Oh, first, if you already cute, do me a favor, hit that like and subscribe. Well, you had to go ahead and push that bell for notifications so, so you can get to school my newest upcoming videos. I can't believe it, everyone. This is going to be the last episode of The Flash. Yeah, this series is a season 9, episode 13. Can't believe it's coming to an end, and what a wild ride it was. Uh, hopefully you guys will stick around. You guys ready? It's time for the breakdown. Let's dive right into it, shall we? Okay, first of all, we see this scene. Someone in black, someone that is eerie familiar. Police are saying, put your hands up. Zoom. Yes, Hunter Zolman's back. Zoom. But we do get a small flashback of where, how, how he actually died in season two. He's coming back. Yeah. As Hunter Zolman, not as Black Flash. We have Jay Garrett. Jay Garrett is there to help Flash out, Team Flash, which is good. We'll get a lot of flashbacks from Season 1, especially from Eddie's death and the singularity of what happened. But the thing is, uh, Barry's going to go up against four speechers. I know, it's going to be, like, crazy. So, let's take a gander a close look. Yeah, Savitar is back. Oh my goodness! This is going to be tough. Not to mention Eddie in the cold blood suit. I guess he doesn't have a mask, okay? But that's all right for now. Eddie has gone really crazy at the moment. He has powers. He could open up portals. Now, I'm not entirely sure what kind of portal this is. It's probably one of the portals that Zoom could open, like, to go to Earth 2 and Earth 1. So in this crystal light, I guess it brings back all the speeches that Barry has defeated in the past. And, well, Barry's going to have to defeat them all. Probably by himself. Who knows what's going to happen. But I'm pretty sure that this is going to be Barry's toughest challenge ever. He's going to have to go through. Which means he's going to need some backup. Like, seriously, on so many levels. So, in this episode, we will be seeing a lot of flashbacks. This flashback was from... Season 3, the ending of Season 3. Uh, and this was the ending, well, last episode of Season 1, Episode 1. And we see someone running around the streets of C Central City. It has to be someone with velocity in their system, which is... Let's take a close look. Let me zoom in. <laughs> yeah, it's zoom. I can't wait to see Zoo back in action. It's so awesome. And we have Savitar. He's about to kill Nora. Yeah. Barry's daughter, Chester. I really did know that someone part of Team Flash was going to end up dying in the finale. Who knows? Maybe Chester will not die, but someone will end up dying, which is sad, in the finale. But Keon, Keon needs to play a big role. Maybe she'll be able to help out fully. We see someone getting tossed through a window. If you take a look at this, oh my goodness, it's actually Cobalt Blue. Well, Eddie, I don't know, maybe uh, he must have pissed Barry off so much that Barry threw a lightning bolt at him and busted him through the glass of jitters. And this is where um, Iris gives birth to Nora, baby Nora, and Nora actually does visit. She comes back to the past well technically the present and so we have jay gear as backup for the finale battle we have nora excess and not to mention wally west yeah so we have three speeches that will actually help barry out but my guess is that if barry's facing all four evil speeches speed force nora has to come back especially all the forces within the speed force the organic speed force the original one that is the only way barry could win this fight i believe other than that hope you guys enjoyed this video if you're new subscribe to channel as always and yes of course i'll see you all in the next one